Hello guys, how are you all? Welcome to my channel, Fracking IELTS 9.0. Today I will be discussing Cambridge 16 General Training Module, Section 1, Passage 2, Test 3. As you can see, the heading says, The Maple Hampton Scarecrow Competition, a great success. Here we have few questions. They are true, false or not given. Okay, so we'll read the information first and they'll then we'll come to the questions right guys there was once a time when farmers all over the country put scarecrows in the fields of growing crops a traditional scarecrow was a model usually life-size of a man or woman dressed in old clothes and their purpose was to frighten the birds away though how successful they were is a matter of opinion great the first question here is traditionally most scarecrows were the same size as a human being okay now he's talking about the size here right guys see he's talking about the size were the scarecrows of the size of the human being let's check see a traditional scarecrow means most of traditionally most of the scarecrows was a model usually life size life size means human size of a man or a woman so it is yes it is a size of a human being like a man or a woman So the answer for sixth one should be true right guys yeah let's move to the next question the competition in september was the first one in Mipplehampton. so whether the competition in september was the first or not that's what we have to check maple hampton's scarecrow competition took place on september 12th local farmers supplied everything needed to make a scarecrow like pieces of wood to form a frame and straw to stuff the scarecrow. The scarecrows were dressed in old clothes which the competitors brought with them. Okay, so here he mentioned about September and the competition, right? But is it mentioned that it is the first one? No, right? He says this competition took place on September 12th, but nowhere he mentions that this is the first one, right? The competition was the first one? No, it is not given. It is nowhere mentioned that it is the first one, hence it is not given. Next, the farmers pr who provided materials could take part in the competition. So he's talking about the farmers who provided materials could take part in the competition. Take part is the keyword. So the local farmers supplied everything to scarecrow like wood and uh, straw. Okay, they were dressed in old clothes, but it is nowhere given that they could take part in the competition, right? He talked about farmers, but he didn't tell that they can take part in the competition. So what is the answer? So clearly this is also not given, right guys? Next one, old clothes were supplied to the people who made the scarecrows. He's talking about old clothes were supplied to the people who made the scarecrows. Look at this sentence, guys. Last sentence. The scarecrows were dressed in old clothes, which the competitors brought with them. Okay. He says the old clothes were brought by the competitors themselves. Right? But what's the, what does the question say? Old clothes were supplied to the people who made the scarecrows. Okay. No, not the people who are making the scarecrows, but competitors brought with them the old clothes, right? Hence, ninth one should be clearly false, right? Competitors bought the old clothes with themselves, okay? They are not supplied to the people who made the scarecrows, right? They are not supplied by anyone. They bought with them, okay? Next, the venue for the competition was changed because of the weather. Let's it was held in a village hall instead of outdoors as planned due to the unusually high temperature okay there were two classes one for the adults one for children all of them working in small teams over 20 teams took part each creating one scarecrow they were encouraged by an audience of around 50 and had ideas and guidance from local artist tracy sanzo okay so what does he tell about the venue venue the festival was held in village hall instead of the outdoors as planned due to the unusually high temperature okay yes so because of the high temperature they didn't plan the festival outdoors they have planned it in the village hall so 
Yes, the venue was changed because of the weather. So because of the high temperature, they have changed the venue. So 10th one should be clearly true guys, right? Okay, let's go to the 11th one. Competitors could get advice on making their scarecrows. So he's talking about competitors getting advice on making the scarecrows. I think we have read something about this, right? So look at the last sentence. Had ideas and guidance from the local artist. So they can get advice from the local artist. Yes, they can get. Of course they can get. So 11th one also should be should be true because they are they can get guidance from the local artist right next in judge's opinion the scarecrow dressed as an alien was better than the giant bird okay so we have to read the passage further now the scarecrows were judged by a team of people from the village the winning children's team made a scarecrow that looked like a giant bird which would surely keep every real bird away. The winning adult team scarecrow was dressed as an alien from another planet and its face was painted to make it look very frightening, at least to the human beings. Oh, wow. Yes, uh, in this passage, he talks about the giant bird and also the alien, right? But does, he, uh, does anyone say that uh, alien was better than the giant bird? No, the judges... They did not say anything right so winning one was the giant bird okay so the winning adult teams was the alien one but they didn't tell that uh, alien was better than the giant bird so it is mentioned nowhere hence the answer for 12th one should be what not after the judging many of the participants and the spectators had a picnic which they had brought some of the scarecrows then went home to their creator's gardens. Elise Cameroon, a local farmer, liked one of the scarecrows so much, she bought it to stand on her balcony. She said she didn't need it to scare birds away from her crops, as only bird scarers that made a noise were effective. She just wanted to be able to see it. The event raised over pounds 300 for village funds. Organizers supplied a picnic for the competitors and spectators. So did they give it a picnic? Who gave the picnic? See, the uh, after the judging, many of the participants and spectators had a picnic which they had bought. So which they had bought. So uh, no one gave. The organizers didn't supply. The spectators and participants, they bought it with themselves. So what's the answer for touching to one? It is false. Okay, next, Elise bought a scarecrow to frighten birds away from her crops? No, I don't think so. See, she didn't need it to scare birds away, okay? She just wanted to able to see it. So, she wanted uh, to see that every day. That's why she bought it, not to scare the crows away. Right, guys? So, answer for 14th one will also be false, right? So we have got all the answers guys. I hope this passage was easy and understandable, right? Please do not forget to like, share and subscribe my channel. This channel is really helpful for people who want to crack the IELTS test. So let's meet in another video guys. Until next time, goodbye, have a great day.